What's up, dudes? I'm getting dinner ready. Here's what I got. Here's what I got out. I have this herb seasoned pork tenderloin. I got this on the sale where it was buy one for $11.99, get two for free. So that came out to $4 per pork tenderloin. Then uh, I have a sweet potato, an onion out, just one golden potato, and a couple of, of apples. And then I'm going to put all of this in the crock pot and let it cook all day. Pork roast tonight, tenderloin. So I opened up my pork tenderloin, and here I wanted to just remind, sometimes when you get a roast, you may notice the butcher leaves some fat on it, and you're like, what a shady butcher, because the other side is like no fat, and then they, they hide their sloppy job on the back, or they try, to, they try to like sell you fat instead of meat. That's not the butcher doing you dirty. That's actually the butcher doing you a solid. And so whenever you have a roast, leave that layer of fat on it. And that layer, when you put it in the crock pot or the pot or whatever, however you do it, that part will go up. And what that is, is it's going to baste it the whole time it's cooking. And so the fat will slowly melt away and it'll baste it. Your, your roast. And so that's why the butcher leaves that up. They're not ripping you off, they're doing you a solid. Okay, I've got my sweet potato. I poked some holes in it with a fork, as well as my golden potato. You can't really see the holes, but they're there. And so I'm gonna keep these whole, and I'm just going to let them roast in here with the meat. And then next, I'm going to take the apples, I'm gonna cut them in half, core them out, and then we're gonna just place some skin down, apple flesh up, along the crock pot as well. And these will roast and kind of be applesauce. Like porky applesauce, it's really good. 